A tall antenna structure stands still against the sky. Routine work underway until one moment of lost position turns height into uncontested gravity. Never ever work on antenna structures without verified anchorage, positioning, and fall protection. At the bottom of a deep excavation, a suspended concrete slab shifts as a crane line tightens. One imbalance, one drop, and the entire trench becomes a zone of unpredictable force. Control lift geometry. Maintain clear exclusion zones and secure loads before anyone enters the excavation. Never, ever work beneath a suspended or settling concrete slab. A load isn't stable until it's fully supported. If it's still hanging or settling, distance is the only protection. On a crowded drilling floor, everything looks normal until one perfect connection suddenly doesn't fit and the entire operation pauses mid-task as the mismatch becomes hazardous. Verify critical dimensions and engagement points before applying. Load. Assumptions don't count as a mechanical lock. The failure comes from missing mechanical engagement. Under load, stress concentrates at a thin edge, making the grip unstable. Vibration and micro-movement break static friction, causing the joint to slip instead of seat. Once it slips, gravity pulls the mass off-center and stored energy releases through sudden motion. The visible sparks are friction sparks from metal scraping as components shift. If a lift depends on a perfect fit, it must be measured, not trusted. Confirm engagement, confirm alignment, then load. A busy paper floor line runs like normal until a forklift advances blindly and the space between two paper rolls becomes a pinch zone in an instant. Never, ever apply force to large cylindrical materials unless they are fully restrained, chalked, or mechanically prevented from rolling. Large paper rolls store significant mass in a round shape, making them sensitive to small horizontal forces. When a forklift nudges the roll, friction is overcome and rotation begins. Once rolling starts, resistance drops and gravity feeds the motion. Momentum rises fast, making it hard to stop or redirect. What begins as controlled movement becomes an uncontrolled rolling mass driven by weight and gravity. Cylinders don't need speed to become dangerous, only motion. If it can roll, it must be restrained before force is applied. A ladder leans quietly close to a large cylindrical tank during routine work until the surface beneath it starts to move after a piece of the roof fell. Never ever place ladders against cylindrical, mobile, or unrestrained surfaces that cannot provide a fixed reaction point. With friction overcome, the ladder's support geometry collapses, gravity redirects the ladder's path, and contact accelerates motion rather than stabilizing it. With both ladder and surface able to move, there's no recovery once motion begins. Ladders require immovable support. If the surface can roll, shift, or flex, stability is already lost. Secure the structure or change the access method before gravity decides the outcome. Inside a home kitchen, a burner stays lit at a low flame while a drawer is open below. One slight contact with rising heat and ignition goes unnoticed for seconds. Keep your head, hair, and loose materials out of the upward heat path of active burners and shut the flame off before reaching below or above a live cooktop. Even a low burner produces continuous upward heat through convection. That rising thermal plume can initiate ignition without direct contact with the flame, allowing combustion to begin before visible flame appears. Hair and oils ignite easily at relatively low temperatures, and awareness can be delayed until the flame grows. Because heat rises, ignition begins above the burner, not at it. Low flame doesn't mean low risk. Heat rises constantly. Control the flame zone, keep clear overhead space, and shut. Burners off before reaching below or above them. Inside a crowded machine shop, spools rotate in steady rhythm until a reach crosses the guard line and stored rotational energy takes control instantly. Never, ever reach into exposed rollers, spools, or rotating components unless motion is fully stopped, isolated, and verified zero energy. Rotating machines convert motor torque into continuous surface motion at rollers and spools. When an object enters that moving interface, Friction creates immediate traction in the direction of rotation. Rotation feeds continuously. Once contact is made, resistance increases grip rather than stopping it. 
Multiple rollers compound the effect, transferring motion from one contact point to the next. Because rotational energy is constant and reaction time is limited, control is lost faster than withdrawal can occur unless the energy source is removed. Rotation doesn't pause for correction. Stop the machine, isolate energy, and never place hands. Inside a moving system, a roadside repair turns tense as sparks bite into a sealed metal container. Then in a split second, heat and pressure take over. Cutting, welding, or grinding around sealed containers is a vapor and pressure trap. Never, ever start hot work until the container is fully emptied, vented, and confirmed free of flammable residue and vapors. A container can still hold flammable residue and vapor. When cutting starts, heat conducts through the metal, warming what's inside. Vapors expand, pressure rises, and the fuel-air mix becomes easier to ignite. Once ignition happens, combustion forces hot gases outward under rising pressure, driven by heat, pressure, and trapped fuel. If it's sealed, assume it's charged. Verify, vent, and isolate before hot work, because the container won't give you a second warning. Inside a busy auto workshop, a car sits quietly until it suddenly rolls forward and crashes straight into the nearest shop area. Never, ever work beside a raised vehicle unless the lift arms are correctly positioned, mechanically locked, and the load is verified stable against movement. Vehicles rely on balanced contact points and mechanical locks to resist gravity. When a car is raised, its mass stores potential energy above the floor. If lift arms are misaligned, unlocked, or overloaded, the center of gravity can shift outside the lift support base. Once that happens, gravity converts stored energy directly into motion. Stability is lost instantly. There is no gradual warning phase. Heavy systems don't fail slowly. When balance is lost, motion is immediate. Lock the lift, confirm contact points, and never trust looks stable without mechanical certainty. In a cramped bakery workspace, a phone slips from a hand and vanishes straight into the open fryer below in less than a second. Never ever reach toward hot oil or open fryers to retrieve dropped items and never allow loose personal objects near active. Cooking Equipment this hazard is gravity and thermal energy. Once the phone falls, gravity carries it into hot oil immediately. Fryers contain large stored heat, and the oil allows objects to enter fast with little resistance. Any reaction after the drop is too late. The exposed surface provides no barrier or delay. The danger isn't the object, it's the open energy source beneath it. Dropped items are replaceable, hot oil isn't forgiving. Keep loose objects away from fryers, and if something falls in, leave it there and shut the equipment down safely. In a narrow storeroom doorway, a heavy box meets a hand truck, and the handle suddenly becomes the fastest moving object in the space. Never, ever manually load a hand truck without controlling the load's rotation path and the handle swing zone. Placing the box onto the hand truck shifts the load ahead of the axle, creating torque about the wheels. The frame pivots, converting the box's downward force into an upward sweep at the handle. With little damping, the handle accelerates upward through its arc at high speed. This isn't footing, it's leverage. Once the pivot begins, control is lost almost immediately. Hand trucks don't just roll, they rotate. Control the load angle and stay out of the swing zone. A cramped auto shop, a car raised for routine work, until one tiny shift at the supports and gravity takes over instantly. Don't work beneath the vehicle unless it is supported on rated lift points and backed up with redundant supports that cannot slip. A raised vehicle stores energy with weight concentrated on small contact points like lift arms or blocks that rely on friction to stay stable. If contact isn't centered or the surface is oily, angled, or uneven, a small force creates a tipping moment. Once the center of gravity moves outside the support base, the vehicle tips as soon as balance is lost. If the support can shift, the vehicle can fall. Lock every lift, back it up. With rated stands, verify contact points, and never rely on balance alone. Don't forget to share what you learned today in the comments. Your insight could save a life. Take care.